This is the using the oxens video. And I'm going to do this in uh, the, the, uh, the full mixer view for all you basic users out there who don't have the wide mixer view. We'll do it right this way. It's, it's just as easy. Very simple to do. And what we need to do is patch in uh, an effect on our return. So I'm going to press the control shift key. Hold that down and right arrow. Get over to the returns there. I'm going to double click up in here and go down to my post effects. I'm going to click in there and open up my post uh, patches window. I'm going to hit my FX and there it is. I want to add the reverb there and I add it. I'm going to take my dry off because I don't need it. Uh, we'll just keep this effect here, add in about 50 or so. Sounds good. Haven't sound, it doesn't sound like anything yet, but it will. And we can close it. We can X out of those because that's set up. And make sure I'm on output channel 1. And, oh, forgot one thing here. Didn't forget yet, but we need to go down here. Oh, right here and label this that will call this the free verb free verb all right got to label it and now I'm gonna hold my control shift key down and left arrow back down to track one now I'm gonna go here to Ox, double click there for my aux end, and we patched it in on channel one. And if I left click in there, I can see there it is, free verb on aux end one. If I left click right on the number there, I can see that. Left click on that, and send one is free verb. I don't have anything on the other ones. Okay. I hit my post button and activate the the send with the end. I go out here and right click. It's that easy. Do you see that? I just added it. No problem at all and pretty simple bring up the fader and, and you have your effect so that is how easy it is to add your ox sends uh i mean an effect to an ox end. and you have you know you have uh various choices to add whatever you want so there you go that's how you do it <laughs>